There's plenty of niggas in Kentucky tonight with them white girls. Where you at? If you're sitting in here with a white bitch. Look, niggas just point right here. Nigga, nigga with a white bitch right here. Nigga with a white bitch. White people don't even get mad when I say a white bitch. The white women are crazy than a motherfucker. You could tell them the devil's in there. Where? I want to talk to him. It's like, what's going in there? Look at this drunk ass nigga right here. With a domino sweatshirt hoodie on. You don't get the fuck out of here. Nigga, what made you get in the front seat? Uh -uh. Put something decent on, nigga. <laughs> oh shit, yeah! Them some African niggas, they don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> what are you saying to me? <laughs> them African niggas, you think they from Louisville until you talk to them. What's up, man? How are you doing today, my brother? They got Tim's on, bulletproof vest, everything. <laughs> Shoot you back. I'm one of them comedians. I'm hitting back, bitch. Pop that pistol on your ass, too, nigga. I'm from right up the street. I'm ghetto like y'all. That's right. I went over to the West End today, never again. That's a, that's a third world country over there. We was driving down the street, a nigga tried to wave us down. A nigga like, this. nigga, we not gonna stop for you. Yeah, stop me that nigga right uh, drive by the jump. You know what it is, nigga. Uh, to do it. This motherfucker Kentucky ghetto as a motherfucker. <laughs> and niggas don't know it, shit. <laughs> they think it's the Derby. Yeah, the derby's nice. Y'all better get ready for the derby. <laughs> I told some white people I was going to the derby. He's like, yeah, you ain't going. Which horse are you? I was like, no, I'm driving the uh, uh, Delta 88 down there. <laughs> There's two derbies down here, ain't it? It's the white derby and it's the nigga derby. <laughs> the nigga derby, you might get shot in the ass, bystander. Yeah, man, y'all need to come back to what's, what it used to be, man. Y this, this young generation, you motherfuckers is ignorant. You ain't having fun. Your pants is too tight. You're killing, snitching, and fucking a nigga. You never see a nigga tell on you and fuck you and kill you. How you gonna beat this nigga, man? Nigga with tight ass pants on with a Uzi. Bring you down, brrrr, fuck you. Take all the money out your pocket and run. You young girls don't know how to ask for it. That's why I tell my nieces and daughters and all that. I ain't telling you to be a hoe, but don't fuck for free. Period. Nigga right. had you all in these different positions. You ain't got no gas in your tank. Right. He didn't empty this tank, but your tank is empty too. Yeah. I ain't telling you to be a hoe, but don't fuck for free. <laughs> Shut up, nigga, in them five dollar seats trying to get some attention. You didn't pay enough to hear you, nigga. Oh my god. Nigga up there with baby powder on his chest right now, holler. One no kind of niggas. <laughs> That's right, you young girls, y'all need to hang around them older women. They know how to ask for some money out there. They can get you some of that hot cop. They got a package, nigga. They put a pot roast on with them corn muffins. And nigga, you done ate good and watch Netflix. It's a package. Think you finna come in here and fuck on me and get out of here without paying. As soon as you come out that motherfucking bathroom with all that carpet and shit, I was wondering, since it seemed like you had a good time that you will put it on your heart to lay a few dollars on me so I can do a few nice things for myself. Get my hair done and nails. How you gonna tell her no? 
here, Mildred. I ain't gonna play with you. Put that hot cock on the nigga and make you buy, buy her a dinette set. Get that brand new dinette. She, she dressed like Total right there. She, <laughs> yeah, I went to y'all mall today thinking I was gonna find a Louis Vuitton. Oh shit. I don't know what no one of it was, but I got stuck at Dillard's. I seen a girl get caught stealing the other day in the store and the security why do people get mad when they get caught stealing? <laughs> What's in your purse? Don't come to me with that. It's like, no, bitch. What's in the purse? That ain't gonna get you out of going to jail, bitch. Get mad. Yeah, you did it. Yeah, that's some real shit, man. Shit, all these beautiful women in here, man. There's some women in here fine as a motherfucker. If you beautiful and you know it, make some noise. That's what I'm talking about, ladies. Don't let them, let them don't let them take your confidence. Keep your confidence, ladies. Don't let these niggas take your confidence. Cause I didn't snatch the many of confidences off the bitch's ass before. Uh -uh. And I regret it. If I can give it back, I'll give it back. <laughs> That's right, ladies. Don't let no nigga do you like that. If you beautiful in here and don't know it, make some noise. Where you at? Okay. We got one dummy in here. We need you to come backstage right now. You are just what we were looking for. Me and Earthquake. Come on, right here. Come right here. How long have you not known you were beautiful? Come right here. If you're not beautiful at all, and you know you ain't beautiful, shit. Look like Sam Jackson a little bit in the face. Make some noise! Okay. We got a couple women living in the truth tonight. Some sprinkles on some Grace Joneses in here. <laughs> Fuck how you look. It's all about to how you look and you know, how your personality is. That's right. You know, how good your coochie is. And if That's you clean, right. nigga, shit. That's right. A nigga will fuck a bear if it's clean. Sure will. If that pussy clean, a nigga gonna hit it. That's right, real shit. Because all the beautiful girls be sitting in the club not having a fun. You know what I mean? They usually ain't got no money. They find this motherfucker don't want nobody in the club. <laughs> Here come three bitches look like Kurt Franklin got bottles, a section. That is stupid. And your man want to hit it. Uh-uh. <laughs> yeah, that nigga Will Smith, that nigga, I, that nigga lost his goddamn mind. I couldn't believe he did that shit. And everybody keep asking me, what would you do did? What would you do did? Fell down. It said my back, my neck, and my back. I would have called the hammer on that nigga's ass. Oh, uh, yeah, nigga. You going to court. Period. I'd have laid there, too. I, they'd have to go to a commercial, nigga. I'd have been, uh -uh. Nigga, I got a car. I'm trying to get out the shop too, nigga. Please. Slap me again, nigga. You gonna stop smacking, nigga. Smack that paycheck out now. Smack that paycheck. Yeah, that nigga, Chris Rock, quicker mouth ass. He made him smack him. That nigga up there. Sound like a 22 went off, man. Bah! Smack the shit out your ass, nigga. Fuck you. He should have caught that nigga backstage. Hey. 
You should have called that nigga backstage and said, Chris, come here for a minute. Boy, you silly. Come over here. Bill, nigga. <laughs> Nobody would have seen it. He'd have been walking backstage like, Will Smith just hit me. I said, I love you, Chris. And left, nigga. Ain't no motherfucker. Say something about another motherfucker. Yeah. The girl must have, uh, Jada Pinkett, I mean, I don't like talking about people's wife, but boy, she must got that good, good. She, she just did a look, and that nigga went crazy. Yeah. <laughs> nigga went from a smile to, fuck this shit. <laughs> nigga, you dead. The fucking move, the, the, the industry, the world is going fucking crazy. I don't give a fuck. This nigga Jesse Smollett got out. That nigga was down the hall from R. Kelly. Nigga... R. Kelly was mad the motherfucker when that nigga got out. But he wanted to go to jail. That nigga wanted to be in a relationship in there. You see how fast he marched in the back? Like, hold up, nigga, let us get the keys out. I want to meet who's in here. They're going to put that magazine on his back. Oh, my God. Look at prison, nigga. That nigga, that nigga. No. That nigga been to prison. That nigga. It's some prison, nigga. <laughs> yeah, shit. Baby daddy, where you at, baby mama? I want to do something to you. Put you in the back of that minivan. And fuck you in the back of Arby's. What? Put that big roast beef on your bum, 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 bum. <laughs> We down south, nigga, and all these girls in here is getting paid by some old nigga with a truck. It's an old nigga hitting everything in here. He be telling people, yep, I'm going to take it to the Bahamas that, that, that summer. We both be going to the Bahamas. I'm going to try to, uh... This nigga that sent a 50-year-old woman back to college, and she back in school. She's back in school. The old niggas want some ass. They don't want nothing else. They act like they listening to you. Uh -huh. I understand. Yeah. But anyway, I got money. This is how young girls ask for some money that they give some pussy. You still gonna do what you said you gonna do? <laughs> do what you said you gonna do, OG. Uh-uh. Don't do that, OG. They look at the money, don't do that, OG. <laughs> What's this, OG? Don't do that. Funky ass money, OG. Yeah, Kentucky is a ghetto motherfucker like Indianapolis. I got my whole neighborhood in the back. Them niggas is crazy in the motherfucker back there. Nap town in the back. The east side. I'm from the east side. Yeah. That's the only place I, you know, I grew up. I, I seen crazy shit like a German Shepherd with motor oil on him. I know y'all seen that down here. Big German Shepherd just silky. Nigga walking through the neighborhood. Nigga had the mange. Nigga just put STP all on the German Shepherd. It's a shiny German Shepherd in the hood. Yeah, shit. My kids, that's why I tell my kids, you motherfuckers don't know about fun in the neighborhood because the neighborhood ain't like it used to be. You remember how you just wake up in the morning and don't come back till the nighttime? Yeah. You done went to every motherfucking neighborhood in the city. You be hot and sweaty as a motherfucker at the end of the day. That was fun right there, wasn't it? 
Everybody hanging out, man. Shit. These little motherfuckers ain't having fun, man. And they got these little dance. My kids, them motherfuckers got dances. They do. I, I take them to the grocery store. This is all I feel right there. They doing this. Stop fucking moving your arm. I got a lot of baby mamas, man. And if you seen, if I line all of them up, you'll see where I was doing good and where I was doing bad. <laughs> you will say he was stealing and everything with her. They was boosting together. That's cold. When you boost with your girlfriend, y'all come in the beauty shop and take sizes. What size your son wear? We going shopping tomorrow, so let me know what we gonna get. <laughs> and he just be standing there telling her, look in the bag, I think I got a nine in there. <laughs> Do your orders now, because I'm, I'm, I'm going to steal next week. <laughs> it's like a real job to him. I think the Nikes will be in next month, you know, so. You a thief, nigga. How you got an inventory on, on all the shit that's coming in? Yeah, shit. I grew up in the motherfucking hood. I watched the motherfucker. Because that's how I do. When motherfuckers be on drugs like that, that's how one of them old niggas was. When I tried to sell dope when I was young, and them dope things, they knew I never sold drugs. They wanted to get me. They was like, no, that's my man right there. Him right there. That's my. Come here. Come here for a minute, man. That's how you know when the old niggas gonna get you when you do that. Come here for a minute, let me hide you for a minute. Don't go over there, he finna rob you. <laughs> <laughs> I tried to run up to a car one time to sell some dope and a nigga hit the bottom of my hand and rolled off. Don't flew everywhere. <laughs> there was a nigga in our neighborhood named Brother Crunch. He ain't had no toes. And that nigga wore British knights. The nigga be walking. <laughs> but he was a drug dealer. Nigga had about nine t shirts on. <laughs> I seen a nigga the other day, man, nigga's feet look so bad. <laughs> and nigga said, you know I got some gators. I said, I'm looking at them right there. <laughs> no, I ain't put them on yet. I said, no, they, they on, nigga. <laughs> them is gators right there, your feet. <laughs> yeah, I love down south, man. This is that real shit right here, man, you know what I mean? Y'all cook good, you know what I mean? It's, yeah. Y'all real slick down here. Some, some real slick country niggas down here. Mm -hmm. <laughs> they know how to start shit up, and you don't know how they started it up. Hit that button right there. <laughs> yeah. I want to do another Friday, but everybody did. Oh, he wrong for that. I didn't mean to say it that way. Yeah, you did. Ain't nobody left but me and Don D.C. Kirk and, and Ice Cube and Michael Black. I've been looking for Cat Williams. They say this nigga in the motorcycle gang now. <laughs> you got to stop filming the show, man. Who you work for, nigga? Because you've been holding the camera the whole night. A thieving ass nigga. This nigga been like this the whole night. I be seeing this shit on the internet. It be unclear. It be fucked up. God, man, let the bitches film me. Weird ass nigga. There's some weird niggas around here. Kill your fucking snitch on you. Remember that. <laughs> yeah, that motherfucker Dave Chappelle, he said some fucked up shit about the gay people. I said, he got a lot of heart, cousin. They'll fuck your money up. 
You say something about the gay motherfuckers in Hollywood, they will fuck your money up. I ain't saying nothing. So I get my money. You say the wrong thing, they're gonna be outside. Fuck my caps! Fuck my caps! And mean it too. They don't bother me. I guess that's their preference, you know what I mean? I tell guys all the time, don't be so angry about gay people because it look like you're hiding something. <coughs> Why are you so mad? <laughs> what happened to you? <laughs> when, where, and who? You know what I'm saying? Shit, I, they don't fuck with me. I don't know if I'm gay. I was in the airport one day, the gay dude was like, let me take a picture with you. I was like, come on. So we finna take the picture, and we taking the picture, and I, something said, look, I looked down, he was looking at me with the, I said, no, nigga, we ain't taking that picture right there, nigga. You got me fucked up, nigga, you finna have me on entertainment tonight. I said, no, nigga, we ain't taking that. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that, Mike. Don't do that. That's how they get you in trouble. Don't do that. Nigga, I ain't did nothing. Yes, you're doing something. Don't do that. He's hurting me. Oh, it's a hate crime. <laughs> yeah, I got all kind of friends over there. My friends' names, y'all want to hear their names? I got a friend over there named Boo Boo Bell. <laughs> Yeah, his name is Boo Boo Bell. I got another friend over there named Ray Bob. Yeah, Ray Bob. I got another friend over there, his name is Mel T. All these niggas got prison numbers too. They've been, the, these niggas been going to jail since they was two. Uh, I got another. We got one. Who said that, they bitch? Now you know better than that. You know I don't like that. How long am I gonna be day day to y'all? Forever? Yes! All the motherfucking movies I didn't did other than Day Day? Yes! What about Roscoe Jenkins? No! What about All About the Benjamins? Yes! Yes! What about Sparkle? What? What about Something New? Yes. What about Meet the Blacks? Yes. What about Next Friday? Yes! What about Friday After Next? Yes! What about the Upshaws? What about high high? What about me at your mama's house in the evening? No! <laughs> Every time I got a movie coming out, one of my baby mamas call. I see you doing good for yourself. Because <laughs> when you pay the child support that I pay, you be mean to your kids. Shut the fucking door! <laughs> Daddy, I got straight A's. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> really? Can I have twenty dollars? Ask your mother. She's getting all the money. Right here, my right. Yeah. All you guys that got sons, you, if any man in here got a son, you going to the nursing home. I'm telling you that right now, that nigga is going to forget about all them football games you did for him. You're going to the nursing home. You're going to be mad in the motherfucker looking at all them pictures y'all was dressed alike. And this nigga sitting in front of the nursing home saying, you lived your life. <laughs> but if you got a daughter, you can live with your daughter. You can have a big ass bed laying right there in the front room with all your medicines lined up. Hell no. And when her friends come over, you can act like you're sleeping, pull your dick out. Hell no. <laughs> Hoping one of them touch it. <laughs> Please touch it. <laughs> 
A man that walk like this will fuck the shit out of you. One of them niggas got a little man. Huh? Nigga, I'll fuck the shit out you. This young bitch think I'm playing with her. As soon as I leave over at the Social Security office, I'm gonna pick up. We're gonna get something to eat. And when they turn around and say, What'd you say, Sugar Plum? That nigga got the shoes with the wheels on. You see him turn around? You ever see two old men get in the fight? <laughs> That's how, what, what, what's this shit I heard you supposed to have said something down me that over at the pool hall up now? Man, I ain't talking about that. Who you been talking about? I ain't talking about that. No, Lower your voice. Lower your voice. Lower your voice. I'll kill you ass. <laughs> then they fall over, change, fall out there. She's just killing her. It'd be an old lady trying to break them up. Y'all stop that. Get up, James. Y'all stop. <laughs> I kill you, Nichols. <laughs> Them old niggas will hit you in the head and shoot the gun at the same time. Kill your ass in here, nigga. He shot me. Them old niggas put a shot. Them niggas just carry a shotgun down here with the trench coat with a rope on it. Nigga, come out. <laughs> You don't know nothing about that right there. That sawed off nigga with the rope on there with the trench coat. <laughs> I clear this motherfucker out. <laughs> Buckshots. <laughs> yeah. I'll know y'all got pool halls down here. Shit. I remember I was shooting dice with some old men and I had all my dope in my arm sleeve. Cause you know when police check you, they ain't, they ain't gonna check your arm sleeve. I took a razor and cut and put all my dope in there. I'm shooting dice with some old men. It was a place called the Apicurian. And I go up in the motherfucker, they got a sign that say, no guns, dope, none of that in here. But all of that's in there. <laughs> Nigga, when I shot the dice, the dope came out. All the old niggas, oh, oh! One of the niggas grabbed me, get your ass out of here, nigga, what the fuck? When we got outside, he said, how much you want for two of them? Yes, a lot of people, ladies. I'm about to stop doing stand-up. I ain't coming back here again. Why? I've been coming here for 20 years. So? I'm tired, nigga. I ain't, my jokes is running out. <laughs> this is it, man. Aww. I don't feel funny no more on stand-up. I'm doing TV now. Woo! I'm selling weed on the side. I got it. <laughs> I got a new thing called the Day Day at the cookie store. Have y'all had the Day Day? Make sure you go to the cookie store and get the Day Day. Yeah, yeah. No, I didn't bring none here with me. You niggas got a reputation. I'm taking shit. <laughs> yeah, I ain't fucking with y'all niggas. I'm hitting the road as soon as I leave here, too. <laughs> No, hell no, I ain't going no fucking Richards. We say Richards? No bitches? No what? No pictures? I can't take no pictures of this. Look at this nigga's shirt right here. Come here, man, stand up. Come here, stand up, and turn around and let everybody... Turn around, come here, man, let everybody see that bad motherfucking... Turn around, man, look at that motherfucker, look good. That motherfucker's a chandelier. A little half Mexican nigga. What, nigga? What? I do remember here last time. We, we was at the, uh, at the, at the, at the Yum Center. And nigga, say what you gonna say before I say it. I'm gonna say it, nigga, if you don't say it. Ah, the last time, 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 time. The, the Jew Jew was here. We, 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 we kicked it, nigga. We hung out. That nigga almost passed out trying to get that shit out, man. Slick ass nigga right there. That's probably how he eat pussy. Nah, 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 I'm bop, 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 bop.
I'm about to eat your pussy. <laughs> Look at her. Well, somebody eat hers. Look at her. Girl, if you don't stop walking through here, I thought that was Rick, Rick Ross with a weave on. Uh -uh. Oh. Triple cheeseburger with lettuce and tomatoes. I'm just playing with you. Hey, baby. You're so cute. Come here. Give me, let me get a kiss on the cheek. Come over here. So fine ass. Put your tongue back in your mouth. Where you doing that? Let me get up. This bitch is crazy right here. No! Nah, we ain't gonna even play with her. I can't see. Where the fuck did she come from? Nigga, I just turned around. She was right there. Imagine if I got her pregnant, man, and Ooh. the whole town of Louisville be talking about it. <laughs> this old lady right here said, they already think you got one here. <laughs> Shut your messy old ass up. <laughs> they already think you got one here. Don't nobody think I got no motherfucking kids here. Shut the fuck up. If it is, it's your daughter trying to set a nigga up. You and her trying to set a nigga up. I think she's pregnant, Mike. That's cold when the mother and the daughter are trying to set you up. When a girl tell you she's pregnant, if you be mad and you go talk to the mother, oh, Lord, you can tell she was in on it. What you think? You better get ready to start working. <laughs> you better get your money together. You got the wrong motherfucker pregnant. For real. The big mistake down by the lake. <laughs> That's why you gotta love your kids. You don't know what they're gonna grow up and be. Is that Rick Ross again? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, I love my fans, nigga. You don't know how good it feel, you know. Kevin Hart, he tried to talk shit to me and said, Yeah, hey, nigga, I'm selling out arena, 60,000. I said, there's all white people, nigga. <laughs> you really sold out, nigga. You sold out, nigga. It sold out. You know how fucking good to walk out here? It ain't that many of y'all, but it's niggas. That's right. And y'all been feeding me my whole career. Y'all been feeding Earthquake his whole career. Some more. Don D.C. Curry. Henry Wells. We the black comedians, man. So we don't even have to have all of that. You know what I'm saying? One thing I can't stand for a nigga that grew up poor to get some money and act like he forgot. That's right. Nigga, that money ain't shit, nigga. And if you keep hanging around them white folks, they're going to start petting you. The motherfuckers, yeah. Them, you be thinking you cool with them, and a the motherfucker walk right up on you and rub your head. What the fuck is wrong with you? You're our little monkey. Them niggas can't come in here and perform in front of y'all for an hour. No, hell no. You wouldn't even give me your money, would you? You see that? Hey, let me tell you something. I know I should be way bigger than I am. But I said no to a lot of shit. Yeah, yeah. Because guess what? You got to be able to live with yourself after you get your money. You feel me? Have some integrity, black men out here. Black men, black women out here, love yourself, man. Love yourself. Drink plenty of water, man. 
You the baddest motherfucker. Leave Kentucky. Get the fuck out of here. Why are you here every goddamn day for months and weeks? The world is huge. You and your girl just get in the car and drive to Nashville or something for the weekend. You hear me? Shut up, bitch. You're a little babysitter. Don't nobody want to watch your nappy head ass kids. We need a babysitter. Look at this nigga, the derby ain't even here yet. Come here, nigga, stand up. Come here, stand up. Turn around, turn around, look at him. Put the oh light on him. Oh my God. That nigga clean as a motherfucker. Looking like L. Cool J. That nigga was cold right there. That nigga had that outfit laid on the bed all night. Damn, I'm gonna kill him. The baby, look at what that nigga what came in here and just threw the hat on there like that. <laughs> and then came in there and put the shoes up under the. <laughs> and then walked past and just threw the glasses on. <laughs> That's how niggas look at their outfit. <laughs> Black people make up colors when they tell you what they had on. Especially when they come from a concert, they call the next day, man, I killed them last night, me and my old lady. What'd you have on? Now, my old lady, she had like a, a Milky Way green shirt. I had a butternut squash sweater with the, uh, 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 uh. And then I, I seen Robert Earl, he had a plum colored long trench with, with a, uh, uh, I think it had like a split pea soup color green on the inside of it. Split pea green soup? Nigga, that ain't no color, nigga. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna get that birth control uh, color bins next month, man, you know what I mean? Yeah, I'm gonna get that birth control uh, color bands next month, man. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. I only want to leave y'all, but my time is up. Don't go. Well, the best way for me to keep going is come up here and put some money on this stage, and I'll just, I'll just keep on going and going. Yeah, fuck them niggas. I'm glad them niggas smacked each other on that motherfucker. They ain't never offered me to none of this shit. Who is this? <laughs> Nigga, that was Sherelle right there. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Monday. I love y'all, man. Thank y'all, Louisville. <laughs>